Welcome to another interesting video with fun and unknown facts. Hope you will enjoy the video. Let's get started. Please do subscribe for more videos and follow us on Instagram and Facebook. The government has told doctors to look out for signs of mucormycosis or black fungus in COVID-19 patients as hospitals report a rise in cases of the rare but potentially fatal infection. The Indian Council of Medical Research ICMR, said at the weekend that doctors treating COVID-19 patients, diabetics, and those with compromised immune systems should watch for early symptoms including sinus pain or nasal blockage on one side of the face, one-sided headache, swelling or numbness, toothache and loosening of teeth. The disease, which can lead to blackening or discoloration over the nose, blurred or double vision, chest pain, breathing difficulties, and coughing blood, is strongly linked to diabetes. COVID-19 patients more susceptible to contracting the fungal infection include those who used steroids during their virus treatment and those who had prolonged stays in hospital ICUs, the ICM are added. And diabetes can in turn be exacerbated by steroids such as dexamethasone, used to treat severe COVID-19. There have been cases reported in several other countries including the UK, the US, France, Austria, Brazil and Mexico, but the volume is much bigger in India. David Denning, a professor at Manchester University and an expert at the Global Action Fund for Fungal Infections charity, told news agency Reuters. Media reports have pointed to cases in Maharashtra and state capital Mumbai and Gujarat. Aparna Mukherjee, a scientist at ICMR, said, it's not something to panic about, but you have to be aware of when to seek consultation. Arunalok Chakrabarty, head of the Center of Advanced Research in Medical Mycology in Chandigarh, said that even before COVID-19, mucormycosis was more common in India than in most countries, partly because of the millions who have diabetes. The treatment involves injections for 21 days. The basic cost of the injections is around 9,000 Indian rupees per day. In an official statement, the Health and Family Welfare Department said that the situation is being monitored and the treatment for mucormycosis is available in the state. The Health Ministry on Sunday released an advisory on how to treat the infection. The cases of mucormycosis infection in COVID-19 patients post-recovery is nearly four to five times than those reported before the pandemic, a metabod-based infectious diseases specialist Atul Patel, a member of the state's COVID-19 task force, told news agency AFP. Some 300 cases have been reported so far in four cities in Gujarat, including its largest Ahmedabad, according to data from state-run hospitals. The state ordered government hospitals to set up separate treatment wards for patients infected with black fungus amid the rise in cases. Treatment involves surgically removing all dead and infected tissue and administering a course of antifungal therapy. But Yogesh Dabolkar, an ear, nose and throat specialist at Mumbai's D.Y. Patil Hospital, told AFP that the drugs used to treat those infected with the fungus were expensive. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe for more videos.